Dubai Air Show 2025, taking place from November 17 to 21st at Dubai World Center, is one of the largest and most influential aerospace events globally. Russian delegation will be part of this incredible show and will present cutting-edge innovations of Russian aviation technologies, state-of-the-art air defense systems, and the latest achievements in UAVs. At the open static parking, Rosmon Expo will present a five-generation fighter zone with the main highlight, the cutting-edge Su-57E fighter showcased for the first time in Dubai. On the static exhibition, you can see spectacular design, eye-catching angles, and impressive armament, and they have a chance to see its advanced aerobatic maneuvers in a dynamic flight program. The Su-57E represents the latest achievements of Russian aviation engineering, combining stealth technologies, outstanding maneuverability, and modern avionics. A wide range of employed guided missiles significantly enhances the combat potential of the five-generation fighters. The armament for a Su-57E displayed at the air show includes the internally carried weapons, KH-69 air-to-surface cruise missiles, KH-58U Shaki-E anti-radar missile, Grom E-1 guided missile, and effective every MD-2 short-range air-to-air missile that were specially designed for a Su-57E, as well as you might see unique array BD long-range air-to-air guided missile with a range of up to 200 km. Is Delia 177S turbojet bypass engine with afterburner and supersonic all mode regulated axis symmetric thrust vectoring nozzle will also be presented near the Su 57E, which is designed for application on multiroll fighters of 4 and 5 generation. Joint stock company Rosborn Export for the first time proudly presents abroad a new aircraft of the United Aircraft Corporation, the Yak 130M upgraded combat trainer. The Yak-130M represents a further development of the well-known Yak-130 combat training. The aircraft is not only ensuring pilot training for a mastering 4-plus-plus and 5-generation fighter aircraft, but also fulfills combat missions in low-intensity conflicts due to installation of onboard radar station, optical locating sighting station, the newest air weapons, modernized onboard communication equipment, and the effective onboard defense suite. Thanks to the new avionics and sighting equipment, the Yak-130M will be able to engage new types of air and ground targets with high accuracy using a MD short-range air-to-air guided missile with extended range up to 40 km. K08BE guided air bomb of 500 kg caliber and the CAP 250 LGE laser guided bomb of 250 kg caliber displayed in front of the aircraft. Other military asset that I would like to tell you about is the Illusion 76MD-90AE military transport aircraft. It is designed to airlift troops, cargo, military equipment and weapons, as well as to conduct air dropping and air landing of personal, cargo, military equipment and weapons at a distance of up to 9,300 km. After rapid reconfiguration, it can also perform firefighting and medivac missions. Our next star is the Kama 52E Combat Scout Attack Helicopter that has undergone a deep modernization based on the results of its combat employment in various military conflicts. It has high performance characteristic, unique maneuverability and controllability. It is equipped with modern avionics, weapons and the set survivability equipment and according to many experts, it is the best combat helicopter in the world. To engage a wide range of ground, surface and low altitude air targets, the helicopter is equipped with a powerful armament system with various armament configurations, depending on the assigned tasks. One of the most advanced weapons is a 305E light multipurpose guided missile of increased range, up to 40.5 km with a 25kg warhead. It can destroy both mowing and stationary targets with apparatus adjustment at final stage of the flight. To increase the combat capabilities of the Kama 52E helicopter, it is possible to integrate the KHMD interspecific multipurpose self guided short range modular missile, which is equipped with the various types of homing heads, which will be presented for the first time abroad, and KH 38MLE missile with a semi active laser guidance system and a powerful 250 kg warhead. Both missiles will be showcased near Kama 52E. Rosmon Export will present a UOV zone, including the well-proven tactical reconnaissance UOVs Arlan-10E and Arlan-30, which will be presented at the static parking. At the UOV zone inside Russian Joint Pavilion, we will present loitering munitions that are now crucial components of the modern orders of battle and they have proven themselves to be powerful, cost-effective and reliable solutions 
capable of wiping out any ground targets and even surface vessels. The Russian-designed Lancet E reconnaissance and strike system with loitering munitions is a world-known asset. The Lancet E was unveiled at the Army 2024 show near Moscow. And now this year's Dubai Air Show will showcase you an updated variant of the system with extended range, more sophisticated guidance and drastically improved effectiveness. At the Dubai Air Show 2025, Rosborn Expert will also demonstrate the Coop 22E loitering munition and the SCAD 350M reconnaissance unmanned air vehicle. The Coop 22E is a medium kamikaze drone that has a range of 40 km and carries a thermobaric warhead. Owing to its sophisticated guidance unit, it is capable of functioning in automatic mode. The SCAD 350M RIS UAV can be operated as a standalone RIS drone or as a reconnaissance asset for the Coop 22E. Air Defense Zone for protecting small size military, including mobile, administrative, and industrial facilities and areas, will be presented by the Panzer SMDE Very Short Range ADMS as the newest modification of the Panzer Type ADMS that is designed for the engagement of wide range of air attack weapons, aircraft, helicopters, UAVs, including rotary wing cruise, guided and accelerated missiles, as well as single rockets of multiple rocket launch systems. The combat module is capable of obtaining air targets at a range of up to 30 km using an airspace surveillance radar and destroying them using 57E6E SAMs or TKB-1055 SAMs. The TKB-1055 short-range interception missile is designed for engagement of a wide range of air targets including UAVs. With the help of this missile and the special transition block, the same ammunition of one combat model can be increased from 12 to 48 missiles that allows the Panzer SMDE to repel massive attacks of the UOVs for a long period of time. The next one is the airspace control system. This is a radar that can also be used separately from the Panzer SMDE ADMS to strengthen the radar field over a protected object. It is designed to provide detection and tracking of UOVs and small-sized aircraft to further prevent their misuse and reduce possible risk of their application for citizens and infrastructure, as well as to minimize the risk of the mid-air collisions and to reduce the negative impact of UOVs on the urban infrastructure. The detection range of its small-sized aircraft is 30 km, micro-UOV 4 km. The next item is Verba, manned portable air defense system that is designed to destroy jet turboprop and propeller driving aircraft, cruise missiles, helicopters and UAVs in condition of a direct visibility on a head-on and pursuit courses in natural and artificial thermal interference. The Verba manpad's engagement range is from 0.5 to 6 km, altitude from 10 meters to 3.5 km. The main advantage of the manpad is the presence of the free-spectrum homing head, due to which the system is highly resistant to interference and has increased capabilities for engagement targets with a low level of thermal radiation. This is all for now. Thank you very much for your attention. We are hoping to see it at Expo stand to see modern Russian military assets in person. See you at Dubai 2025.